Stevenson Falls to Widener today at Owings Mills Gymnasium. Glenn Clark with head coach Gary Stewart. Coach, um, I, I know this did not go the way that you wanted it to do. How much of it was stuff that you guys did wrong versus them being a you know, veteran team that did a lot of things right? But you know, incredible Widener. I mean, I thought they played out of sight. Uh, we just could never get a tourniquet on it. Like, I felt like every single possession we were chasing, chasing. We couldn't get the ball under uh, control. And so now all of a sudden we're chasing the ball. And, and um, they do a very good job of finding the open guy, regardless as to who it is. And we paid dearly for that today. Coach, how much of it was a lesson about, like, you, you can't stop for two seconds? You know, we saw that a couple times today. They would run an efficient offense, and then, you know, you get a rebound, and they were right back to defending two seconds later. How much of that was a lesson to your team of, like, this is what it takes to play 40 minutes of basketball? Well, I, I think that they are, are very astute and, and aware of what needs to get done. Uh, I think the question, uh, Glenn, is uh, can you get it done? You know, uh, knowing what to do is one thing, and doing it is, is a different thing. And, and again, I credit Widener. Um, you know, what I saw out there today is uh, some old dudes, uh, some grown men, and, uh, and we didn't handle the physicality of the game very well. And um, conversely, they, they uh, continue to put bodies on us and, and get physical with us, and, and, uh, and it was to our detriment. Coach, uh, they will have the camera pan down and see that you got your uh, sneakers on today. I know with Coaches versus Cancer, it's suits, suits and Sneakers Week. Can you walk me through why this is so important to you and, and what the idea is of Suits and Sneakers Week? Well, you don't have to even uh, go any farther than that gymnasium at the start of the game. And, and Connor Laverty is uh, just a terrific student athlete at Widener was the conference most valuable player. I uh, graduated and then coached with uh, Chris Caridio. And, um, you know, to lose uh, a young man like that so early to cancer, it's just devastating. I mean, it, it really is. I mean, I, I'm getting a little bit emotional just thinking about it, you know. Um, uh, and again, you know, I started off saying he was a terrific guy, but it, to, to anybody that is stricken by cancer, uh, it, it's not only that individual, People that love them and care about them, family and friends. Such a devastating, devastating diagnosis. And, and we're going to continue to work. Uh, there's a whole lot of folks that are pouring in everything they can to ultimately find a cure for what is a crippling disease. Well, we, uh, we, of course, send our thoughts and, and our, our prayers to everybody and the uh, Widener family. It's, I, I echo the sentence, unfathomable uh, to lose Connor Larry. It's such a young. Um, reminds you that uh, we keep things in perspective, obviously, coaches. There are things far more important than basketball games. Uh, we will see you back out here on Wednesday night. Thank you as always for taking the time for us. Thank you, Glenn. It's Gary Stewart. I'm Glenn Clark. Go Mustang Sports. TV.